Ruler School is brought to you by Happy Little Hug Factory and these amazing patrons. Thank you for your support. Enjoy the video. Hey there, rulers. Welcome back to Force of Will Ruler School. This is DMO73 bringing you the deck profile for the ARG Canna of War list. Totally a meme, um, but it is an interesting idea, so I wanted to kind of run it over because I was getting some questions about it. The ruler is our Canna of War. It is the basic ruler. We use it because we have those two filter counters, those limited counters, to get us access to green um, so that we can play Lorites. It's a divinity of six, and then judgments for four, and on its backside is just a vanilla 10-10. Um, so nothing really to shake a stick at there. Stone-wise, we play four Dramaturgy, four Stone of Time, and two Stone of Chaos. We play Machines, we have access to things like Distortion of Time, and sure, we need to two more Blue Stones. Um, the rune deck is Scrap and Build, which only costs one and is a chant rune, so we can play it. Um, if the game goes long, you know, or they kill all your early stuff, you can play this for one blue and suddenly spam a potentially big machine out onto the board, like Percival, um, or a Lancelot. Blessing of the Sun is really great if you have an established board. We use one of our filters to be able to play it for one white, um, get everything a big pump, swing in, and then recover it at the end of turn. Invitation only costs two blue, uh, and we can search us for whatever card we need in the deck. Explore the Unknown is free, so we don't have to worry about using it as a filter. Uh, it is a little bit expensive, but this is to primarily dig for a Lorite, uh, so that you have a Lorite to be able to answer Time Spinning Witch. And then Sandstorm is Sandstorm, it's a free rune. So this probably gets replaced, I think, for some lists uh, with the new rune that's coming out in New Dawn Rise, or Strange is a New Valhalla, the like two drop that becomes a one drop void. Um, but it might stay the same. Um, going into the main deck, it plays, it's a pretty much a straightforward machine shell. It's for Vivian to be able to tap and generate a ton of counters. Mechanized Knight for early aggression. Donut Drone to be able to put more counters on things. Distortion of Time, because we're a blue deck, so why would we not? Uh, Lorites 3, Lorites 7, Astro uh, Astrologian. Their list played 4. Uh, I played 3 and 4 Keys' Call. I played 3 of each because I wanted to make room for some other things. Um, namely, a couple Percivals. And then um, I'm only playing... Uh, I, there was one other card that I kind of... They were playing for Distortion of Time as well, so I took that down to three, and I took it down to three Gawain to be able to play a couple of Merlins, just so that the game has a, the deck has at least a little bit more end game, um, rather than just being purely just let's just go all in on machines at the beginning game, and if we run out of steam, then we're dead. Um, Merlin's great for being able to grab you kind of whatever machine you want. Percival lets you do little Percival loops if you get to it. Um, Gawain is a very heavy hitter, especially if you have a couple Sky Rounds on board. This guy comes in and he'd be like a 3-drop 12-12 with Swiftness. Um, very devastating. Uh, Lancelot Glass Knight obviously is kind of the main kind of linchpin of the whole deck, generating a ton of counters, being your spot removal, being your board wipe, stuff like that. Um, for Castle in the Sky Sky Rounds obvious it's a machine list and then four sky round technician mainly to help mechanized knight not be so bad um, but you can get some pretty early aggression come in um, with a mechanized knight and a sky round technician on turn like one two um, but yeah that's the list huge thanks to the ARG guys for shipping me this list it was a ton of fun to play it's very very goofy don't recommend playing it competitively um, because it was purely a meme but it is definitely a fun deck to take the locals so if you feel like trying it out and being silly and playing a ruler that doesn't have an energize um you can give it a shot but thank you guys so much hope you guys enjoyed the deck let me know if you have any ideas for what you could do as other silly arcana of war lists or arcana lists in general uh, but until next time this has been dmo73 saying class dismissed